Hi, my name is Dan Brett. I'm the CSO of Poundcraft. We've just released version 2.9 of our product. I'm here with Rich Farrell, our head of product engineering, to talk about the top three features in the product. Rich, tell me about these features. Go. Hi, Dan. The first of the three features that we're bringing in with 2.9, it really covers ease of use and deployment. Uh -huh. We've created a system that allows the, um, the when, a, when a customer is deploying a uh, deception service, mm -hmm. the notifications are automatically set up for them. So if there's any interaction with the service, they automatically get the notifications without having to configure it themselves. That makes the life a lot easier and it makes configuration a lot quicker. Additionally, we have also um, increased the coverage of operating systems for the platform. So we now have an extended um, Red Hat and also SUSE, which is a new development for us. Fantastic. So you can now install things a lot quicker and across a lot, lot wider base of operating systems. That's right. Brilliant. Okay, next thing, what's this um, query language stuff I'm hearing about? Ah, oh, right, yes. The second really cool thing is any game a query language, EQL, which we've deployed throughout the pro product. Uh, basically, it allows our customers to use a really simple search language that provides really powerful results. EQL stands for end game query language, and as you remember that, end game were bought by Elastic, and so this is the same language that's supported throughout the entire help stack which means it really reduces the overhead on learning mm -hmm. because if you're familiar with one set, you're instantly familiar with this language used throughout our product. So it's going to be easy to find people who are comfortable with using EQL, is that right? Absolutely. And not, not only that, Dan, it's really, really simple to use because it's super human readable. Right. And so what's the third thing? The third thing is uh, the fact that we've integrated the new version 9 of the MITO attack matrix. Now this has been incorporated throughout the product. Again, if de events are detected within the deception environment, they're auto automatically correlated against the MITRE attack um, TTPs from this new version. Fantastic. Okay, so that's great. We've got a whole lot of new stuff. We've got improvements in deployment. We've got some fantastic new query language and the updates that happened in MITRE. Any last little thing you might want to add in before we go? Because I know there's a ton of other stuff there. Oh, we've got some really cool features such as the ability to take screenshots of the Windows Deception hosts. So you can really get a snapshot of what someone's doing on your Deception host. You can actually see what's happening. That yes, sounds great. Absolutely. Okay, yeah. Well, listen, to find out more about 2.9, check out our blog and subscribe to find out more about Cabin Craft. Mm -hmm.